a new warning about a commonly used Halloween safety accessory that could land your kids in the doctor's office. Well, new at noon, Action News' Jack Beth Russo shows us how to avoid a call to poison control this Halloween. The Poison Control Center says that glow sticks are great and can make your kids more visible in the dark. But they say that the safety accessory can quickly become a hazard. This is Ada Rodriguez's son's first costume of the day. He's a dinosaur today, early for school. So then later on, we're going to change him to vampire. We caught up with the mom in between her Halloween festivities. Before costumes, Rodriguez thinks about ways to keep her four year old safe while out trick or treating. I don't let him eat the candy. We go home, I make sure I go through the candy and go through everything before he can have him. Doctors at the Poison Control Center tell me calls surge on Halloween and most of them are about glow sticks. They break open and we end up getting calls. Dr. Don Soli says complaints about the safety accessory more than double statewide on this holiday, from 61 calls to 150. That will cause irritation on the inside of their mouth, or if they get it on their skin, it will cause irritation to the skin. Rodriguez says her son always has a glow stick in hand, but he knows better than to break it open. Oh, no, he knows not to put it in his mouth. He's four years old, he'll be five, so he knows. He's very aware. Poison Control says it's not just glow sticks that sends calls skyrocketing on Halloween. Coming up, I'll tell you the other products that they're warning parents about. All new on Action News Jacks at 5. Reporting on the South Side, Beth Russo, Action News Jacks.